Cool. And I'm Juliana Rancic with Ken Baker in the E! Newsroom with a recap of what just took place moments ago in the courtroom as Chris Brown received his formal sentencing. Ken, let's talk first about the restraining order today that some people expected to be lifted, but shockingly was not lifted. Yeah, we had uh, two really interesting things happen. One, what we expected, he got the five years of probation with six months community labor, which will be done in Virginia, which is what we expected. Right. The surprise here was that despite Rihanna's attorney asking that the restraining order, which doesn't allow them to have any contact whatsoever, they can only be within a hundred yards of each other at any time unless they're at an industry event. Right. Rihanna wanted that lifted. The judge said, I am not lifting that. Mm -hmm. In fact, this protective order is to be in place until 2014, until the end of his probation. Very serious. She said some very interesting things. She said, I'm not immune from the chatter. This is the judge referring to all the media attention, mm -hmm. speculating whether Chris and Rihanna were back together. And she issued him a warning. She said, remember, this is a felony. And she said, you will go to state prison if you violate it. What she was saying is that you cannot have contact with Rihanna. So as far as all the speculation over whether or not Chris Brown and Rihanna would get back together yeah. after the sentencing, According to the judge, this cannot happen if he has any contact with her, any personal contact, whether it's on the phone, in person, or not, he can go to state prison. Wow. Very serious words from her, wow. and uh, she was acknowledging this is a very high-profile case, and she dealt with it as so. And this is shocking, Ken, because, I mean, we're talking here five years. Because in the past several months, we've been kind of hearing, and, and photographers have been trying to capture them as they sit apart, you know, one rest, one sitting in a restaurant across the street from the other. People are hearing they're in the same hotel at the same time. A lot of people thinking that these two were eventually going to get back together, especially with Brianna trying to lift that restraining order. And now the judge saying, not only am I not lifting the restraining order, but for, this is happening for five years, so they cannot get back together for at least five years, even yeah. if they want to. He has a lot of work ahead of him. He has to return to court every three months to check in. He's got to go back to Virginia. He's going to start this immediately within 72 hours, so right. it's going to be very interesting. Thank you, Ken. Quite a shocking day here in Los Angeles. For the very latest, tune into to e